All right, folks, welcome back. Today we are heading into Hope Thrift, one of our favorite thrift stores. Last time we were here, we found a full set of Ping Golf Clubs, and this place always has really cool uh, Disney stuff, so uh, definitely stay tuned. But never know what you're going to find, though, so... Let's go find it. Let's go find it. All right, the only thrift store that we actually start and look at the uh, furniture section. They've got some uh, Grand Floridian sinks still in here. Got the uh, Grand Floridian headboards as well. We got the uh, Wilderness Lodge uh, little table set right here. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. They haven't had that in here before, the uh, towel warmer. $75. That's and that's pretty fancy. Mini fridges and microwaves. There you go. That's all you need. Towel warmers and uh, microwaves and you're good to go. What else we got over here? Oh, this is the thing that goes over the AC units. Mm -hmm. I think this was at the uh, Shades of Green or the uh, Wilderness Lodge. I don't this remember. This nice too. Oh, yeah. That's a super nice uh, dresser. Whoa. Whoa. Fancy. I don't know what the purpose of that is, but, but it's fun. It was a resounding whoa from us. <laughs> I think this is also from uh, Disney Resort. Mm -hmm. I can't remember which one that is. They have tons. Resort Rolling Storage. Whoa, that is. Huh? Yeah. How does it store? Oh, there's a, a drawer. Ah. <laughs> a couple of geniuses uh, over here. Get a, a daily look at our. Well, not daily. We don't come here daily, but we get the uh, your update. obligatory look at the uh, sonogram. <laughs> it is still here. See if they've got any other uh, Disney. Oh, they got the uh, safe boxes over here. I wonder if they actually went through and looked to see if there was anything in here. I would hope so. It's a pretty good gamble at $38. They just literally took them out of the uh, walls, though. That's, crazy. That's kind of uh, crazy. But uh, let's see if there's anything else. Got a couple more Disney chairs of there, Disney couches. Hmm. Got some new stuff in. Oh, this one's definitely new. Grand Floridian nightstand, $55. And it's got USB. Yeah, it's got USB uh, outlets in it too. That's that really thing, cool. That thing has seen better days for sure. Well, let's see if we can figure out how this drawer works. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> we got some more resort furniture over here. This is an entertainment center. Oh, the fridge? fridge is in there. Huh. Included. I don't know if that's included. Well, I guess it's included if it's yeah, in there. You can see how, what size it is. Yeah, you can, you can measure to see if it'll fit in our uh, car. They literally have everything at this thrift store. I thought these were Rain-X for a second, but they are Michelin. I wonder if they have one. We need to get new ones. We gotta we'll look those to up, see what size. size. Power Rangers. Man, they've got everything. It's a red box. Whoa, <laughs> it's a red box. That's amazing. Four for three dollars. You can go through here and have yeah. some uh, fun for and sure. Promo video. Oh. Cast gag reel and more. Hmm. They've got some uh, 50th anniversary Castle Sugar Cookie Kits over here. I wonder if those have expired yet. Well, it hasn't even been a year. <laughs> the uh, <laughs> one year anniversary has gone for uh, 16 months, or it's going to go for 16 months. It uh, no, it doesn't expire until May 22nd of 23. There you go. We'll have a uh, little contest so you can build the best <laughs> castle sugar cookie kit. Okay. For $3.99. I'm in. You're in? Oh, you actually want to do that? Not particularly. I'm afraid I'm going to chip a tooth on that even though it's yeah, not expired. It looks pretty uh, hard. <laughs> oh, no. It's the first time I've ever seen Olaf ready for summer. Or those 3D glasses. I'm not sure. What do you got? It's a Mickey shoe soap Whoa, dispenser. That is pretty awesome. We were just talking about the F50. Oh, it's got a little chip. He stubbed his Don't toe. We all chip on our shoe and our shoulders. <laughs> yep. Let's go look at the uh, shoes now. I think about it. Man, they have a bunch of uh, brand new shoes. Only ten dollars, not included in bulk sales. Not sure what that uh, means. We got some Echoes right here. Echo golf shoes go for a ton. These are the uh, biome kind of like walking shoes. Whoop. Uh, I was checking to see if they still look. Oh, yeah, oh, those are LA Gears. Yeah. I always wish they had those in my size. <laughs> Me too. That was a sad day when I grew out of those. Yep. What else we got? Oh, ice this is skates. cool. Whoa. Ice skates in Florida. Yeah. They're not a hot seller. <laughs> what else we got? Disney parks. Oh, these look sweet. I think these are. Oh, yeah, they are Echoes. Are they the go... We were literally just what? talking about them. That is kind of crazy. Let's see what size they are. They're it's European like sizes. Yeah, yeah, these are like mint. I'm like a 46 or a 47. Where does it say? Usually it says on the bottom. Oh, here we go somewhere. 47. 47. There you go. I don't know how much the shoes are back here, but we will definitely inquire. Yeah. Those are super nice. Crazy. Some of the Echo Golf shoes are like ridiculously mm -hmm. expensive. Heading back towards the uh, golf clubs, there is literally every single letter up here. They're all like a bunch of different signs. Where did they come from? It'd be kind of cool. How do they spell? Yeah, it'd be kind of cool if you like pieced them together in yeah. different signs. Let's check out the golf clubs over here. Got a big Bertha head cover. Let's see what else we got. Looks like a full set of these tour edges. What is this one? Got a great bit. Oh, that's the biggest big Bertha. That nice. one's kind of cool. Not a uh, super uncommon, but still kind of cool. Got an AMF putter. Kind of looks like an ISO pure insert on them. Tour edge iron set. Got a McGregor putter. Oh, no, I don't think you have this uh, chipper. No. <laughs> nice. Dunlop. True world's tail. largest uh, chipper collection ever growing. Sweet. 
Let's see what else we... Oh, we got the uh, head coverage of that biggest big Bertha. Nice. Oh, nice. We got a uh, Adams Tight Lies 2 spin control. It's like the same model in that year that came out with the uh, Faldo ones. Mm -hmm. Those are kind of uh, cool. Golf clubs in here are only a dollar, so definitely pick that up just for uh, fun to hit out one day. Wilson Ultras. And a ball retriever. Oh, yeah. That is the goofiest looking ball retriever. <laughs> I never understood how those ones work. No. Yeah. I st stand that up uh, in a uh, lightning storm. You're guaranteed to uh, get hit with that. No, thank you. Cool. Sweet. All right. A couple of golf clubs. Still think the shoes are winning. We gotta oh, beat yeah. the shoes. Gotta beat the shoes. It's us versus the shoes. Oh, man. We weren't able to film it because it was like buried in there, but yeah. this is. I think this might beat the shoes. Yeah. If you guys have uh, watched our main channel, two of our biggest videos ever were the uh, Kirkland Signature Wedges and the Kirkland Signature Balls. Yeah. Those were like our some of our first like really big videos. So mm -hmm. definitely a little nostalgia there. That is awesome. Because I think that might actually fit me too. Yeah. I saw a guy walking around in a Kirkland Signature t shirt the other day at Disney, and I was like, kudos. Yeah. I don't do Disney t shirts. I'll you never see it with. Like, yeah, usually you'll see like K-Sig stuff, but you never see like their actual branding yeah, on cool. it, which is uh, super cool. <laughs> Let's go check out the, uh, I think that beats the shoes, even though the shoes are worth way more. But, we uh, still have time though. There could be something yeah. up there. Let's go uh, see what the uh, Disney stuff is like. They usually keep the cool Disney stuff up here. Oh, well, this is pretty cool. We got a press coin collection 50th anniversary if they're in I've there. I've seen that. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's just, you have to do it yourself. Mm -hmm. That's just like the little holder, kind of yeah. like the autograph book. But the uh, press coins, they're like... They used to be just like you put in a quarter and then you would get like you put in a quarter and a penny and you get the penny back that was yeah. pressed. Now it's like four bucks. <laughs> and you can't even use coins anymore. You have to use a card. Oh, really? It just like ruins the experience we're, for me. Yeah, we're falling uh, behind in terms yeah. of uh, the times here. The good old days. Got a uh, old school popcorn bucket. They still have a uh, Mickey painting wall. That's uh, so cool. Yeah, that is a. Oh, man, look at this. We got a uh, golf tournament oh, winner. We act like we won. We won the uh, golf tournament at Evans High School in 2002. Go. There you go. I would have been, I don't know what I would have been in 2002. <laughs> Got a bunch of uh, picture frames, 50% off all picture frames. Disney Resort frames, not included. Let's find a Disney Resort. Oh, speaking of uh, Disney Resort frames. Oh, man, that is so cool. These are straight out of the uh, All-Star Resort. Didn't that is, is garage yeah, sale? we found a couple of them at like, garage sale. Those are super cool, though. Huh. I think they were like $50 at the garage sale. We'll have to uh, ask how much they are going for here. Yeah, but that be is... Donald, Donald. Is it the other one? They're all the same? All Donald. Yeah, that's the one that I wanted. Yes. That is super cool. I have to ask about that. We are waiting in line to uh, check out, and this is like the first time ever that there's not people over by the uh, pins. It looks like they actually change stuff out like very frequently. I always thought it was going to be like the same stuff. We've got a bunch of uh, up characters right there. What else is new? Got a really weird looking uh, Jack Skellington with a uh, hat going on I here. Like the donut ones. The donut ones and are pretty the awesome. Popsicle. Popsicle. Look yeah. how little hidden Mickey. Oh, it's not very it. hidden. It's just very small. Did you get it though? Pause. I got it. Yeah, okay. I think you made that joke before. <laughs> it was funny the first time and that time. But Thank you. Only got a bunch of uh, Mickey ears over here. I've never seen these ones. Oh, those, those are cool. cool. Huh. They also have ones that are fanny packs, which I think are hysterical. You and your fanny packs. Mm -hmm. You got figment. It's pretty sweet. Updates to come on the uh, little picture frame action going on. Oh, and tonight's treat almost as cool as that last find straight out of the All-Star Resort. How cool is that? We spent a total of $50, but yeah. check this out. That it's is like a awesome. Corn dog, but it's cheese inside. Yeah, I assure you later, never had one of these things. We we're gonna get Mofungo and then we saw this. It's, it's like a corn on a stick. cheese on a stick. What could be better than that? Besides our finds today, we got the Kirkland signature, the uh, awesome. Adams Addy, uh, Addy, Ashley added to, <laughs> that was hard for me to say, obviously, Ashley added to her ever growing chipper collection. Yes. Got those Super Echo sick. shoes, which basically covered the entire cost of yeah. the All Star Resort thing. That That's was so really cool. cool. <laughs> We've got a couple of videos just like seeing cool things, but this one actually finding and being able to uh, buy it. Mm -hmm. I think it uh, makes up Added for it. Added to our collection. Added to our collection now for sure. Let's see if we'll add this to our repertoire of uh, foods. I'm assuming this is going to be very hot. Yeah. So <laughs> what is it? It's like cornmeal and cornmeal then fried and then, cheese. Yeah, in the middle. Oh, On a yeah. stick. That, you can, it's mobile. It's perfect. Yeah. Is it hot? Oh, a hot butt, but I don't think I've gotten into Do you know cheese shot. yet? <laughs> All right, we'll let it cool down here for a second. <laughs> Ashley's burned her mouth. I can usually eat things like 20 times as hot as you. <laughs> Bite. Don't bite the stick. <laughs> it's so good. I think the cheese is in it. Oh, it's like cooked throughout it? <laughs> All right. Oh, you handed it to me without the stick. Oh, <laughs> All right. I'm going for a big bite, big bite. Yeah, I think the cheese is in it. It tastes so good, oh, though. Man. You can see the steam coming off of it. <laughs> That's incredibly good. 
I think that's better than a corn dog. And a good corn dog is hard to beat. How are you doing over there, boss? <laughs> it's so hot. Oh, man. That tastes so good, mm -hmm. though. The cornmeal is like super sweet, which normally I don't like super, super sweet ones, mm -hmm. but that one works. Yeah, if you added a hot dog into this with some cheese, Next level. Cheese corn dog. That's next level. But hopefully you guys did like this video. Daily vlog number 33, I yeah. think. Somehow we've amassed uh, almost 12,000 subscribers. <laughs> I think our main channel took like quite a bit of quite time. a long time to uh, do that. <laughs> we've been doing this for just over a month. So thank you guys for the uh, support. Yeah. But we'll see you with another video tomorrow. That's why we call it a daily video. That is indeed. Let me see if there's more cheese in the middle. I think it's yeah maybe. It tastes good regardless. Oh, oh, that's it. oh, that's so hot. That's good. <laughs> that's very good. I think we would have liked the mofongo better. Yeah, I I had to try fried cheese on a stick. Yeah. <laughs> There's a mofongo place in uh, New Smyrna Beach that's like super popular, and then it went up for sale because the owners didn't want it anymore. I don't know what happened to it. I don't know, but that place was incredibly good. Yeah. So good. One day soon. Mofongo. Coming soon. Mofongo. Come, that's what people subscribe for. It is. Ashley and uh, the food reviews. <laughs> and just some random dude talking to them for like 20 minutes behind the camera. Behind the camera. Now in front of the camera. Yep. We'll see you next time. Bye guys. There's gotta be more cheese in here. I think it's, it tastes so good though. I guess it's kind of disappointing. You're disappointed. No, no. Oh, I found the shoes. <gasps> oh, best find of the day. There we go. Look at that shoes. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Just as I insult you, you find the cheese. Yeah. Six hours later, we got to the cheese. Oh, I think it melts and then goes to the bottom. Yeah, yeah. Like the uh, Taco Bell. Oh, there you go. It dripped out. It's like Taco Bell. It's like, where is the cheese? And then the last bite, it all squirts out. Oh, the guacamole. Yeah. All right, let me get the bottom bite. Yeah, there you go. go I think it. I think we figured it out. Hold on. I'm not How uh, long does it take two adults to figure this out? Very long time. Apparently three minutes and 33 seconds. Yep. That's how long this scene is. Ready? Go for it. The cornmeal itself is very good, but the cheese oh, really is next level. Now you know. Oh yeah. That's where it's at. Bye guys. <laughs> Still hot. Still hot. Just like you.